is wonderful tonight, Felicia. I am so proud of you. Why aren't you getting dressed and ready for your on-stage questions and crowning? We need to gift you in your evening gown. Someone stuck a bunch of pins in my dress. I can't even get it unzipped. I don't wear sparkles or heels. I memorize theorems and write proofs. I'm just gonna drop out of school and, and get a job. I just have to wait another year to graduate. No, honey. I know it may not always seem natural, but you have worked so hard for this. Don't give up because of some mean girl. It's time this pageant world crowned a girl who did more than read magazines. Someone who writes theorems and memorizes proofs. Let's get you ready and out there for your onstage questions. You can show them just how smart you are. Do you guys need some help? I'm not in top five, so I can help. Yale 139, Harvard 136. If Yale wins this question, they will win the match and go on to the National Collegiate Mathathon in two weeks. Next question. Prove that there are infinitely many primes. You may not add to your answer after you hit the bell. I have rules to follow. Yale has the correct answer. So Yale will be going to the finals in two weeks. Congratulations to the funky function. But don't get too excited yet. We have to keep our focus on Operation Bobcat. We are going up against the best team in the country. Stay in touch with your center core. Okay, girls. This is the moment you've been waiting for all your lives. On stage question, then crowning. See you out there. The day I won Miss Connecticut was the best day of my life. So go and enjoy the most of it, ladies. Go out and smile big. Oh, act smart, I know. Oh, oh chest up. But keep your heart open. Oh, and make sure you make eye contact with the judges. So very important. And I do want to tell you that I'm really very excited to get to work with one of you ladies for the next few months because we're going to be training for Miss America. Contestant number three. Hold oh, oh, up, that's you. If you could reform the educational system, what would you change and why? The United States is only number 19 in the world in math literacy among high school students. Investing in the improvement of math education would help increase the number of contributions that we make to the global community in science and technology. Using programs like Math for America as a model for recruiting teachers would serve to benefit our system. Thank Furthermore, you. I think it's important to increase our priority level in society for education by increasing teachers' salaries. Why should a basketball player get paid millions of dollars when teachers only get $30,000 a year? Thank you, Felicia. Next we have Miss Nutmeg, Vicki Bentley. How can we encourage the next generation to be honest? thereby avoiding scams like the teens who cheated on the SAT last year. William Shakespeare said, honesty is the best policy. If I lose mine honor, I lose myself. We all need to abide by this policy in every aspect of our lives. If we live our lives with integrity, then we set an example for the next generation. Thank you, Vicki. Congratulations, ladies. You are all excellent representatives, but only one person will be chosen as Miss Connecticut. In the interest of preparing you for Miss America, which has to compete with all the reality shows for ratings, we are going to announce the top two contestants and then have you play a game to determine the winner of the title. Our top two contestants and contenders for the title of Miss Connecticut are 
Miss Nutmeg, Vicki Bentley, and Miss New Haven County, Felicia Roberts. I have three bags. One bag contains a $15,000 scholarship, the opportunity to compete for more at Miss America, and of course, the title of Miss Connecticut. Two bags contain nothing, but will come with a runner-up scholarship for $5,000 and an unlimited supply of nail products. Now in the event that you choose the same bag, we will begin again and keep playing until we have a result. Audience, please be quiet. Vicki, I will ask you to leave the stage and go into our soundproof booth backstage. Felicia, please choose a bag. Three. Bag three, great. Now I will show you one of the bags that does not contain the title and $15,000 scholarship. Felicia, please leave the stage. Vicky, please choose a bag. One. Bag one, great. Now I will show you one of the bags that does not contain the title and $15,000 scholarship. Felicia, please join us on stage. Now here is the part where you get to decide if you would like to stay with your original choice or switch to the bag you did not pick. Felicia, would you like to stay with your original choice or switch? I'd like to switch. Vicky, would you like to stay with your original choice or switch? I would like to stay. Please give the contestants their bags.